Be in control of the money. Spend less than you earn. The key to prosperity is to live below your means. This rule applies if making 30,000 a year or 80,000 a year. Our spending habits can get so crazy that a person making 80,000 or more does not have enough money for all of his or her expenses and somebody making 30,000 a year can have a retirement savings account and much more. Understanding where your money is going allows you to know where you can cut. Together, the latest gadgets, a new phone every three months, a newest expensive brand car, a huge house, for example, you'll break the bank. For sure, some of these things are important to us and we deserve to have them, but at what cost? If at the end of each month we feel like the rope is on our necks, stressing out with payments, the real words for having material things starts fading away. Peace of mind and being stress-free is more rewarding than having a big house we can't afford to show off to people that don't care. Not having the dream car today does not mean we can never have it. Adequate planning can get us there. Developing a budget will help stay on track and realize where money can be saved. For example, instead of buying that daily $5 Starbucks coffee, we can brew our own coffee at home or go for a more affordable option. $5, 5 times a week equals over a hundred dollars a month allocating wealth once on track spending less than we earn we should start seeing cash flow coming in this is a good time to start working on the emergency fund having money saved that we cannot touch remember it's for emergency broken car or layoff Sorry, the new Marvel movie that came out or the Apple iPhone 20 will not qualify as emergency when you can't save anymore, increase the amount of money coming in. Get a raise at your job or a better paying position or become more skilled increasing productivity or acquiring a skill that will be higher rewarding. Multiplying the savings rate, once running out of time around 40 hours a week, find ways to get the money to work for you. Here is where we need to educate ourselves so we can invest on things we fully understand. Schools teach us so many things that many times we go entire lives without using. As of today, we do not get any financial education unless we take a business course in college. We study all our lives so we can get a daily 8 hours job that will pay our bills but beyond that we have the option to educate ourselves on how to use the result of that 8 hours daily work to our benefit instead of just blowing the money away. Becoming knowledgeable allows to develop strategies and investments that will grow the money such as a high yield account or money generating assets. Leave your comments down below, let us know what's the investment you're currently looking at. Please like and subscribe, thanks for watching.